Welcome to the latest episode of Branding the Experience, where we discuss ways where we can create environments where employees actually want to come to work and customers want to keep coming back. Hi, I'm Ken Bader, your host for Branding the Experience, and this is one of my favorite times of year. You know, obviously, it's September. And it's one of my favorite times because it's strategic planning season and I get to do a lot of strategic planning sessions and strategic discussions on, on the next year coming up with, with a lot of my clients and prospects. But even more so than that, it's football season, my favorite sport. I always have such a good time uh, throughout the fall and, and into the winter in football season. Definitely one of my favorites. And I had some fun earlier this week in my podcast with what can we learn about culture building from football. Uh, and there's an article I post around this time every year, what can we learn about strategy from football. But since this is a branding show, what can we learn about branding from football? And I think the number one thing, especially as it applies to, to our theme for this show, as well as my brand principle of creating an environment where employees want to come to work and customers want to keep coming back, is that we have to have a clear identity and not just an image but an identity because we can create an image that frankly is false you know we could create an image that we are a great family oriented restaurant and people could come in and, and not get that experience it could be filthy with only a couple of choices on the menu or the buffet we can create a false image that that we are a, a family-oriented credit union or bank, for, for instance, and people could come in and not get that experience, get kind of a standoffish, rude uh, type of, of an experience. So it's not just the image, it's the identity, because identity goes deeper. It's the image that we portray, as well as who we actually are, so that if we say, we're the best credit union for police officers in a three county area and somebody from law enforcement or spouse of a police officer comes in you know they should feel that we really do understand their needs and why their particular situation is different because they work in law enforcement and not any other particular profession you know, if we have an identity of being a true upscale restaurant then and we're going to put that image out there to drive business to that restaurant you know, then you know we're going to have an actual experience where not only the food is high quality but so is the service, so is the ambiance. Uh, you're not going to have tables right on top of each other. You're going to have some space. It's going to be a true upscale experience. So it's not just image and it's not just you know, trying to wing it. It's a true identity that what we portray in an image is the actual truth and actual fact. Yeah, same thing in football. You know, I'll give you my favorite team, the Bears. Yeah, they've been trying to find an identity for years. You know, for a while they tried to be a defensive team. You know, under Lovey Smith, and yeah, that never quite really came to fruition the way it should. And then they brought in a new coach in Mark Tressman, and they tried to be you know this great offensive juggernaut. And you know that worked for a real short time, and then that blew up in the second season. And yeah, now, you know, they've got a coach, you know, named John Fox, and, you know, he's trying to work out all the kinks from the last two coaches and create an identity, and, and hopefully, for my sake and all my other fellow Chicago Bear fans, that they'll actually have an identity uh, of running the ball and having a good defense so that everybody on the team understands exactly what their identity is and what their role is and that's where we can learn something from football and having that identity and not only having a true image out there that we're marketing in different ways but also have a truth to that image and a true identity that what we say is going to be the experience for customers is the exact experience that they experience in that particular business. So 
hope that you're branding the experience at a very high level and I hope you're ready to enjoy a great football season as I am as well. Go Bears and take care.